I use a light board to make videos for the students to watch before class so that they can prepare for class. When I decided to do a flipping the classroom sort of uh, video technique, I searched around on, about how to make the videos interesting, visually stimulating for the students. Um, many people use a like writing on a tablet or a notepad and then speaking over the top of it, but I found, as you can see, that I speak with my hands and I feel like in physics your expression kind of tells part of the story and I wanted that to come across in the videos. There's a lot of available products out there that make this very expensive <laughs> um, setup, but um, actually you can do it pretty cheaply. This is just a piece of plexiglass, and, and if you just keep it nice and clean, you can light it with lights from the side, and I'm just holding it up with um, two by fours. I stand behind it, and the camera's in front of it, and there's a black background behind me, and I use neon markers to uh, write on it so that the writing looks illuminated um, from the video and then I flip everything so it's right to left so that um, the students can read the writing <laughs> as normal. Put out your right hands. <clears throat> QB, there's the book, the first component. Crossed with B, that's B into, so my finger is pointing towards me and away from you and the force is the thumb pointing upwards here. So you can see using the right hand rule that you should get a force up. <laughs> the first day, um, a bunch of students asked me if I knew how to write backwards. <laughs> and it was especially difficult to do the right hand rule because I had to do it with my left hand. <laughs> so after the students um, watch the video, um, in the evening before class, they get to answer questions about it and reflect on what happened and it prepares them for the next day. And the next day in class, we, um, we use their responses to construct relevant class material like activities or group work or reviews of things that they were confused about uh, in the video. I wanted the students to be able to come to class feeling confident and prepared for lecture. Uh, I wanted to uh, equal the playing field, make everybody feel ready for class and um, engaged, like they've already had some of the ingredients they need to create the recipe that we're making in class.